Hi everyone, it's Rivia. Welcome back to our channel. In the previous video, we have shown you how to use Rain Mirror as an app to make your desktop more tidy using an already matte wallpaper. So we actually matte that wallpaper using only Canva. And in this video, we will show you how to do it plus a little tutorial with Rain Mirror. To start, we open Canva web by typing canva.com on your search bar. Canva is a very easy and free web to create a design. It also contains a lot of cute and great elements for your creation. And to make this wallpaper, first you must set up the Canva size to be desktop wallpaper size. Here you can create whatever background you like, but we will all, we will use a grid by just clicking elements and searching for grid elements. Adjust the size to match your Canva. And for organizer, we decide to use rectangle shape and insert a few of them to categorize for our apps later. You can change the color by clicking the color icon on the upper corner and just the one that matches your background. We decided to choose gray because it's a calm color and it's blend well with cream. And then put on text for each rectangle title to categorize what item we will put on our wallpaper by clicking the text option to change the font. You could also change the font size whatever you like. For this one, we will use Bebas because it's a simple font and match very well with our design. And after that, you can put every element you like to make your wallpaper more aesthetic. We decided to choose a shadow branches. And you also uh, can choose uh, wildflower elements and change the transparency to blend it well with the design atmosphere. And to make it more appealing, we will put some photos by using a Polaroid frame. I will take some photos from the website pexels.com that contains a lot of free stock photo and royalty free image. And I will put uh, this cat and flower photos and then upload them to Canva. Adjust the photo size to match the frame size so it won't look out of place. We will put a layer on the photo to blend the color well with other design by using shape and changing the transparency.
and we're done let's just download the wallpaper and install it on your pc you can see that with this wallpaper we can just categorize our apps here i will put chrome zoom whatsapp and telegram in the social category and notion mendeley and microsoft apps in the school category also the others and the other two rectangles i will use it as a clock viewer and music player and we were gonna use the rain meter apps here just like in the previous video i will use saunders and clockwork world skin for this wallpaper and first just install the skin that you have some skins will appear in your windows but you could just unload it if it's not your preference I will insert the music player manually by clicking the rain meter icon in the text bar from clock word skin and vertical clock by Saunders to match the rectangle boxes. You could also change the design settings, just right click and the option will appear. And then I will use Spotify for the music player, you can just start turning in the music you like. And we're done! Now your wallpaper be more tidy and organized but still looking aesthetic. And thank you for watching our video and don't forget to take us if you follow this tutorial. Consider subscribing and leave the comment below. Stay tuned for our next content. Bye!